my friends. So today I'm very excited. So you probably don't know this, but my friend Heather Parrish um, has a million typewriters and because I am a writer and love to write stories and all the things, she felt that it was necessary that I have a typewriter in my life, but I wanted one that was a little baby kin that I could put in my camper, in my van when I get it done. So she found this one on Instagram at Jot and Tittle. There you go. Heather is behind the camera and I'm going to show you her typewriters um, at the end of the video. But, so it came in the mail. I'm crazy excited and so we are going to take a look you guys i'm so happy i got one of the felt pads so that it makes it not be sound like you're tearing the house down this is from laura at jot and tittle a little note and then oh what is oh this is um ink or like a yeah a ribbon yes a typewriter, a typewriter ribbon, ribbon. <laughs> Sorry, I'm still. It's, it's, it's okay. I don't want to get these peanuts all over your entire house. Well, you know, may, be a kid. You can do it. it may not. We can, we can do it. Okay, you guys. Oh my gosh. Look how little it is. <laughs> and it's in its case still. Okay, I'm gonna move the box out of the way. Now, wait until you see what color it is. You're gonna die. 1,000% you're going to die. And you know what's so weird is the one I was looking at that I kind of wanted was a different color. And in my mind, I kind of saw like what kind of stories I would write on it. And then when I saw this one and the color of it, I was like, it's just a totally different mood. I don't know. Like, I think there's going to be different stories. Heather always says, like, the typewriter has its own voice. It does, and maybe um, it just means that there might be another typewriter in your future. <laughs> maybe. But I can totally see that now. Look at this case, y'all. Oh, my gosh. I can't even handle it. I mean, let me move this out of the way. Thank you guys so much for wrapping it so well. How little it is. I mean, oh my gosh, the little that case, case is phenomenal. Once it's not wrapped with bubble wrap, it'll go in there all the way. Look at that case. How oh wonderful. my gosh, <laughs> do y'all see the color? <laughs> what did I do with the scissors? <clears throat> I mean. Can you even handle that? It does not make you happy. <sighs> I don't even know what to say. Get all this wrapping off. I mean, look at it. <laughs> How cute is that? Oh my gosh. Okay, we're going to have to get some paper and type some little notes. All right, you guys, let's type on it and see how it looks.
guys enjoyed meeting Henrietta, the little baby turquoise typewriter that will be joining me on many adventures in my van. So stay tuned for that. Thank you, Jot and Tittle, for finding her and breathing life into her and for packaging her so well and getting her all the way to Alabama. And thank you so much to my dear friend Heather for hunting her, finding her. Heather is a great typewriter hunter. Um, she is my creative community support, somebody that believes in my craft and that challenges me and cheers me on and supports me and just pushes me to be a better artist and writer. And so, friend, I deeply appreciate you. Um, I'm going to show you guys a little mini tour of some of Heather's typewriters. Um, I hope you guys enjoy. Thanks for watching. I got to go because I got stuff I got to write. See y'all later.